Let's bring in our uh, five finalists. Girl number one, Mallory is 21 years old. She's 5'7", 135 pounds, blonde hair. Uh, Mallory, you want new boobs yes. just be in, in one sentence. Tell us why you want new boobs. I want new boobs to be more confident. To that's be more my confident. one sentence, but yeah. I that's not I may not be as deserving as all the other girls, but I would be the most appreciative of these boobs. I would make sure that they are seen. Oh, and yeah. Oh, that, really? Yes. What, are you going to go on the internet and post pictures all over? I, they'll be seen. Okay, all right. So, uh, you you want to pose for Playboy? Yes. You uh, have, uh, you were in a mental hospital for yes. 10 days. <laughs> Um, you are, uh, you're on depression medication mm -hmm. and let's see what else you, that's it. That's it. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's go to girl number two. This is uh, Sarah who's 21 years old. She is tiny. She's just 4'10". Um, she is the girl you had the birthmark all over your body and this really affected you as a child, right? Yeah, it did. Um, I want these boobs because honestly, every surgery that I went through was for like something I couldn't control. And the outcome of it, like, my confidence went, like, way down. So getting these boosts will make me feel better about myself, and it's something that I actually want to do. All right. That makes sense. Uh, she had a huge birthmark all over her body, has done many, many surgeries for that. She had scoliosis, if you can believe that, rods and pins in her. It gave her a staph infection. Had to take her back out. Uh, yeah. Oh, my God. A mess. Girl number three is Angelique. She's 29 years old. She's an A cup. Uh, hi, Angelique. Hi. Um, explain to us in one sentence why you should get these boobs or why you want them. Um... I want them because you wouldn't just be giving me boobs. You would honestly be, this would be a new chapter in my life, a new turning point. Um, and I, I, like number one said, I'd be so appreciative and so grateful. She <laughs> that is, you could um, do this for me. she's the one that uh, was married and her husband kept cheating on her, uh, knocked her up. She has a child, uh, f uh via rape by her husband. She, uh, let's see. She was the first girl to sign up for boobs this year I'm at, at Rover Fest. <laughs> um, and, uh, let's see, what else did we learn about her? Is she was that, raped, yep. STD. Oh her yeah. Her, her husband kept giving her STDs. Right. Contestant number four is Jennifer. She's 35 years old and, uh, boy, where do we uh, get started with, mm -hmm. with Jennifer? She has batteries implanted in her chest which with wires going up to her brain because she had a, an experimental ocd treatment uh one of only 12 people is this a more common surgery do they do this much more now but you were you were the 12th person that ever had that done right yes all right but now they th now this is a more common thing they do it to, to more people than they did back then right yes all right uh she uh, let's see what did we learn about her she um she well, she was locked up at the neighbor's uh, attic and she was molested. Right when she was five years old, that's For what years. gave her the OCD. Um, right. She was roofied twice, Rover. Roofied twice in her life. One time at a restaurant in the bathroom. Right. Sexually got, assaulted in the bathroom. Right. Uh, beat up, taken to the hospital. And contestant number five is Sherry. She's thirty-six years old. She wants to be a webcam girl, an internet porno cam girl, right? Yeah. Uh, and that is, that's pretty much your only reason for wanting these boobs, correct? Well, yeah. And to, you know, make me, make me look better. Talk right better. into the microphone. Oh, there yeah, you go. Sorry. There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And uh, so you want to look better for yourself and you want to show these off on, on camera. All right. All right. Uh, let's go around the horn here. Dieter. Well, I'm going to eliminate a couple of rubber right off the bat. The first one, because I said Mallory's boobs are already so nice and perky. I don't think you need to touch those. Doc's even smiling at him. He knows they were a great pair. He's so <laughs> freaking horny. <laughs> Angelique, her, she has a very pretty face, Rover. Uh -huh. I think she's blessed in that department. She should just stick with that. And I think she's jaded with men now because of the boyfriend. I don't know how many guys are going to see her new boobs. Oh, so okay. I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take her out of it. Um, Jennifer, sad story with the batteries. But if some guy's licking those boobs, Rover, he might get zapped by the electricity. <laughs> you know what I mean? I've had a history with getting zapped. I, like a bug zapper, I, basically. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so she's out. So I'm going, Rover. I'm sticking with number two, Sarah, who's had a very hard life. Yeah, with really, the birth, birthmark girl. Yeah. I really felt for her, Rover. I, I I had to hold back a little bit there. because I'm. She almost. I've, I've never, ever cried on this show, mm -hmm. ever. 
she almost got me. You man. almost oh, started crying. Yeah, I started. I had to move around a little bit in my chair. And then, and, and Sherry, it's a toss up between Sherry and number two rover. Sherry is, is the webcam girl. The webcam girl. Okay, and wait two. a minute. Wait. You're kicking me out. Wait a minute. Me and Sherry have the same reasons, and her boobs are bigger than mine. No, I. Yes, they are. Want to do a side by side real quick? Yeah. Rover, this is so tough. But who's going to do the most to help the world, Rover? Oh, God. Shut up and make the world a better place. Uh huh. Oh. I don't electrocute people. Oh my people. god! Okay, keep your comments. It's my time to talk, <laughs> Rover. I'm going with. Oh, forgive me, God. Sherry, the oh, webcam oh, girl. Sherry, the webcam girl, number five. She will help the world out the most because guys will be cranking that to her. She'll oh, help wow. out horny guys. Right. Sarah, I'm so sorry. All right, Charlie, who's been operating one of our cameras here in the studio, tell me what you think about these girls well first i want to just i'm just gonna go right off the bat eliminate one she had nice boobs you have nice boobs already number one Gosh, Mallory. she has no, really nice but, boobs no, if i saw I those but imagine what they would look like with implants they would mess them up um, they're, no, yeah, they're shaped and they're perky no i don't they're think they're perky they mess them up. they're great mess them up. you had perfect boobs you I need to deal not. with your perfect boobs and oh quit asking God. for free boobs <laughs> and taking boobs away from these deserving girls <laughs> because your boobs are good i'm not saying you don't deserve them but your boobs kick ass already Go home but with that thought instead. All right, All right. so you that leaves boobs. between number two, three, four, or five. Five's out too. Five's out. You don't like the webcam girl. Why? Yeah, it's just it's nothing against you. It's just uh, you want to make money with it. But the other girls really depressed me. Okay. They made me feel bad. Yeah. Two, the birthmark, how depressing. Three, the the kids rape, and then the the four or five rapes or whatever. I that's depressing. Yeah, and uh, girl number like, four with the with the batteries and everything. And so um. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna pick number three. Jeffrey, uh, tell me what do you think about these five contestants and who would you pick? That would be a difficult one because they've all had good stories. Okay. And um, Mallory, I like her because uh, you know she's got the perfect breast. You know, uh, maybe just make it make maybe one size bigger. Uh huh. But uh, I think um, I like Angelique because she's tall. And I think uh, a little bit bigger breast might help accent, you know, better pr portion out her body. Okay. On my entry, I put that Jeffrey could be the first one to motorboat. Oh, wow. Oh, that's why right. he caught wind of that. Wow. That's Did why he picked that? her. Did he get to read that? Uh -huh. He read it. All right. Let me, let me tell you here what I think. Yeah, what do you think, uh, Robert? Who, um, who's it down to with you? Well, let me, let's go through. Mallory is girl number one. You do have a nice rack. You're a cute girl. You, you do have a nice rack. Thank you. I disagree, though. You, well, I, I think they're nice. They could be guys. better. They could be better. Sure, you're absolutely they right. They could be better. You're absolutely right. I promise right. that my story is really, really sad. It's just that the medicine makes me not cry. Uh, I understand. I can't cry. I I'm understand. happy. <laughs> yes, all that antidepressant that you're on. It's, yes. Sure. I could punch her in the face and she'd smile. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um... <laughs> Sarah is a is a uh, heartbreaking story. I could really feel for you having to you know be teased on, uh, picked on as a kid with this uh, birthmark of yours and all of the surgeries you've had to endure, which must be very painful and uh, kill your self esteem. Uh, so Sarah would definitely be in the running in 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 uh, my picks. Yeah. Uh, Angelique, girl number three, uh, she seems very sincere about her uh, want for this. And I think she's honest. She says, this is for me. She has these kids. She uh, seems to have a uh, tough life. Uh, that, that would put her in the running for me as well. Uh, and then uh, girl number four, Jennifer, the girl with the batteries. Um, I mean, what an incredible story this is. Uh, the, the fact that you have these implants, you have this OCD, uh, uh, all the stuff that you have endured throughout your life. I think that's a very compelling story as well. Um, so she would be in the running. Yeah. Now, Sherry, girl number five. Um, look, Sherry, uh, uh, no offense, but, I mean, you're kind of a wackadoodle, it sounds, it sounds like to me. But webcam. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> look, no, no, I, it's, it's, it's great that she wants the boobs. There's nothing wrong with, with the reasons why you want them. It's just hard for me with, with all of these other girls. Girl number two, girl number three, and girl number four who have just heartbreaking stories that could uh, bring a tear to your eye to say, okay, I'm going to give it to someone who just wants to, to get on a webcam and get naked for uh, guys. Um, so th in, in my mind, that leaves between girl number two, girl number three, and girl number four. 
Now, girl number four, uh, I, I here's I, I'm a little concerned about the medical stuff that you have with these with these batteries, these wires. So it sounds like you're down to two and three. I'm down to two or three. Oh. Sarah or Angelique. Oh, God. Here's the moment of truth. Girl number two or girl make, number did three? Did she vote? No. Oh, come on. You should make the, her make no. the decision. No. She no, might no, be no, biased no. because she interviewed these girls. No, I've mm-hmm. spent time you with should, them. You should I bring can't. it down to her. No, I've spent too much time with them. Suji, you shouldn't oh. make one. If it's she between makes girl number two and girl number three, who do you give My it to? My pick was girl number four. <laughs> okay, but, but girl number four is not in it. Girl number two or girl number three. The I decision can't... rests on Doogie. That's it. That's my final what? decision. Yeah. <laughs> what are you guys That's right. That's about? right. On to you, Doogie. Doogie. Yep. Hey, Doogie. Oh, oh my God. You picked me twice, <laughs> like two years in a row for the interviews. So that must mean something. You can't do this. Yes, That's not fair. Yes, yes, he can, can do what he wants. Yes, it's a show. I can. And I, and you I'm, are I'm such a wimp. And for the record, the fact that you admitted you had gonorrhea, Angelique, Rover had chlamydia. Oh. So there you go. What does that have to do with this? I just wanted to get that out there. I'm going to write down. I'm going to write I'm gonna, write, I'm gonna write down. I've, I've written down Jeez. on this uh, card here who I have uh, picked, but I'm uh, and I'll show you after the fact. I think I know. In my mind, write it down. I, I it is. I, I already wrote okay. it down. It's Fold it up. She, she can't see it, Rover. Okay, let's fold it up. All right. It's um, between girl number two, Sarah, girl number three, Angelique. Who are you picking, Doogie? Uh, both have heartbreaking stories. Angelique, you're beautiful. You uh, don't need breasts to make you beautiful. You've gone through a lot of crap. Um, I think you're on the right path of uh, making your life better. I think the breasts will help you. Um, but unfortunately, I have to go with girl number two. Because girl number she two? Has given, she has gone with... The, such horrible things in her life because of the birthmark and the cruelty that she has faced. And I'd like her to be happy once going into a surgery room knowing that this will make her a better woman. And wow. I'm sorry. All Sarah, right. Congratulations. Do you guys, do you want, do you want me to hold up this card of who I yeah. wrote down? I, I would have picked girl oh, number three. Wow. That's who I wrote down. Three. Girl three is who I picked. That's who I picked. Yes, that's who oh, I. Oh wow! So now she's mad because it should have been your decision. Oh great! Our, my decision was uh, it was to give it to you, Doogie. Well, can you split the boobs, uh, doctor, for one boob? <laughs> yeah, they each get one boob. One, right each, boob. one on each back. <laughs> yeah. Sarah, congratulations, yeah, girl number two. You said a good point. It's finally, a good surgery. Angelique is very, very deserving of these, I know, though. I, I mean, I really feel horrible. I, I mean, if we can somehow get Angelique these boobs, too. I, I mean, I don't know what we can do. But, well, Jeffrey's uh, book profits can go towards her. Jeffrey, so would you be them. willing to give the profits of blood in the studio to girl number three who you picked to get her new boobs? Jeffrey? Jeffrey has kids and a family. I wouldn't no, have Oh, he wouldn't care. spend that money on those kids. I wouldn't, he, anyways, I take it for he would just, He's going to buy a wrestling ring for his backyard. <laughs> <laughs> would you do it? What? Would you take your book profits and give them to her for new boobs? I can't do it. I have, I have, I have, I have other things. I got, I got selfish. Yes. He has care. a new computer. He's, he's, he's to got buy. a fan. No, right. no, it's right. not that's that. Right. It's, uh, right. Let's see, Christmas shopping and bills and uh, food and well, all listen, that kind of good listen, stuff. Listen, 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 listen. Oh, uh, Doctor Goldschmidt, you said that you will give a deal to any of these girls Absolutely. that did not win. You'll give them a fantastic uh, knockoff half price or whatever. Absolutely. And, and uh, okay. Uh, really, all the girls, every single one of you, uh, great girls, very deserving. And uh, Sarah, congratulations, congratulations to you. Sarah. I hope that this changes your life for the better. And I hope that I, I made the right choice. Make us proud. Well, well I didn't make did. it. Doogie did. But I make Doogie proud. Make the whole show uh, proud.